So you have a Samsung Galaxy S21 or S21 Plus and you have an issue where you have a black screen. Basically, it's a black screen. However, you know that the phone's on. Maybe you see some LED light, you feel it vibrate. Maybe you're getting phone calls and whatnot. Anyway, it's on. The only thing is it's a black screen. We're gonna go ahead and get you guys up and running right now. So the first thing we're gonna do here is we're gonna force it to restart. Now, this phone is working, but let's just pretend I have a black screen, okay? I have no idea what's going on. So the first thing is this. We're gonna force it to restart. What we're gonna do is we're gonna press and hold the volume down, the power button. Press and hold both buttons. Do not let go until you see, see, it, you see a Samsung logo appear. So we'll do it together, ready? Volume down, power, ready? One, two, three. Press and hold both buttons, do not let go. Pretend my screen is black. I have no idea what's going on. I'm just holding these two buttons down, hoping for a Samsung logo to appear. Still holding, still holding the volume down and power button. Still holding, patiently waiting. Come on. It's coming. Where's that Samsung logo at? Still holding. There it is. Go ahead and let go, and you just force it to reboot. And hopefully, you now have, uh, you don't have a black screen. However, if you still have a black screen, we're gonna go to the next possible step. Okay, so the next thing we're gonna do here is, we're gonna do the same thing. We're gonna force it to restart while it's plugged in. But before we do that, what we wanna do now is, it's possible that your power button or your volume rockers could be jammed or stuck, causing the black screen issue as well. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna spam the power button, okay? Just go ahead and keep clicking in and out like this, the power button. Also the volume rockers, up, down, up. Just, just keep on clicking it. If it's stuck or anything, get it all nice and loose, okay? Now go ahead and grab your power cable, plug it in, and we're gonna go ahead and um, leave it charging, okay? So it's charging now. Let's just pretend my screen is still black, and now we're gonna do the same thing, okay? Volume down, power, one, two, three. Press and hold, pretend my screen is black, Still holding on to volume down to power, just waiting for the Samsung logo to, to appear, then I can let go of both buttons. Still holding, and while it's still charging too, okay? Still holding here. Come on, where's that Samsung logo? Still holding. Still holding here. There it is. Go ahead and let go, let it boot back up, and hopefully you no longer have a black screen. If, if you still do, then we're gonna to go to the next possible step. All right, next thing we're gonna do is go ahead and unplug the phone. And what we're gonna do here is what I call the tap method. What we're gonna do is we're gonna tap two fingers all over on the screen and all over in the back. Because what typically happens is you can have something that's slightly dislodged that, that makes the black screen. However, sometimes a few taps, nice hard taps on these, either the front or the back, will turn it back on. So we're gonna go ahead and do this, okay? Go to the screen here, grab two fingers and hold the phone like this. And what I want you to do is just start tapping all over like this. Now sometimes when you start tapping, all of a sudden the black screen may go away or sometimes you'll start seeing like white lines, okay? It's okay, just keep on doing this. Turn it over and do the same thing, okay? Tap, two fingers all over, okay? Even on the top here, even on top of the lens here. If you don't want to get the lens dirty, I mean you can use like a, a cloth or a paper towel or anything like that. Just keep tapping all over like that. And look over, okay, nothing is on there. If it's still completely black, then from here do the same thing. Force it to restart. Hold the volume down and power button. Press and hold at the same time. Do not let go until the Samsung logo appears. Once the Samsung logo appears, go ahead and let go. And hopefully you guys are back up and running. If you're still down, the next thing we're going to do here is what I call the massage method, okay? We're going to do the same thing as a tapping, except this time we're going to massage it. So grab your phone like this, and you can grab something if you don't want to get your screen and all dirty. It doesn't matter. But just go ahead and hold the phone like this. With your two thumbs, what I want you to do is just press in like this. Just keep massaging it like this. And look at your screen too. Sometimes again, like I said, you're gonna see like some white lines or some flashing or all of a sudden just the, uh, the phone's gonna turn on as well, okay? So keep doing this. Turn it over on the back, same thing, okay? Press, press in all over, all over on the top here, even around the camera lens. Give it a nice push, turn it over. See if the phone is on, okay? If it's still black, then from here, force restart it. Remember, volume down, power. Press and hold both buttons. Do not let go until the Samsung logo appears. Once it appears, hopefully you guys are back up, back up and running. If you're not, the next thing we're gonna do here is what I call the smack method, okay? Simply hold your um, hand out like this. Also, I, I'm not responsible for anything happening, so do everything at your own risk, okay? But I've gotten a lot of these Samsung phones up and running by simply this method as well. 
So grab your hand like this, your palm, and what we want to do is we want to smack the back and smack the front. So we'll start off with the back here. Just keep tap, smacking like this, also on the bottom. And sometimes you'll see something pop up too. You might want to try to like click the power button once in a while, and all of a sudden your screen might be on, or you may, may see some like white lines or half of the screen pop up. Anyway, just keep tapping or smack in the back and also the front, okay? Give it a couple smacks like this. And now if it's still black, do the same thing. Force it to restart. Remember, volume down, power. Press and hold both buttons. Do not let go until the Samsung logo appears. Then go ahead and let go. And hopefully you guys are up and running. Now, the last thing I have for you guys, if you guys still have a black screen, is... The last possible fix I have for you is, is doing this, okay? And this sounds like ridiculous too, but what you want to do is just grab your phone the way it is and you want to go into your, put it in your freezer, okay? The, the uh, freezer, the freezing part. Put it in there for like 10 or 15 minutes. After 10 or 15 minutes, take your phone out while it's nice and cold and go ahead and try to force the restart. Volume down, power, press and hold buttons, do not let go until the Samsung logo appears. Now, after the freezer method, if you guys are still down, Start from the very beginning, step one, and try every single step, okay? All the way down to the freezer. Doesn't work? Do it again. Start from the very beginning. Try this five or six more times, okay? Sometimes it takes me like six or seven more times until finally it turns back on and I never have an issue again. Anyway, let me know uh, what solution worked for you guys or what solution or combination of solutions you think worked for you. Uh, and give me a thumbs up. If it didn't work for you, give me a thumbs down. I'm going to say at least 70% of you guys should be up and running.